Now to Nasarawa State, where the Governorship Election Petition Tribunal, sitting in Lafia, has declared David Umbugadu of the People's Democratic Party as the winner of the March the 18th Governorship Election. Chairman of the three-man panel, Justice Ezekiel Ajayi, ruled that the petitioner proved his case and scored the highest lawful votes cast. Godwin Aguam reports. It's a day, day for the judgment of the Governorship Election Petition Tribunal holding in Lafia. Leaders of the All Progressives Congress, APC, and the People's Democratic Party, PDP, alongside their lawyers, make their way into the premises of the tribunal. Delivering each judgment via Zoom, the tribunal declares David Umbugadu as the winner of the March 18 governorship election. It held that Mr. Umbugadu scored the highest lawful votes cast at the polls. And the tribunal came to an irresistible conclusion that based on the polling unit results, where elections held successfully, collated successfully, but were wrongly entered into the world result from ECAB. Taking a look at all the results from the polling unit, there is no doubt that Honorable Umbugadu won the election by the majority of lawful vote cast at the election and was declared by the tribunal. But one out of the three member panel gave a dissenting judgment and dismissed the petition filed by the PDP for lacking in merit. The dissenting judgment held that the governor of Nasara State, who is the second respondent, Engineer A.A. Sule, is the winner of the March 18th, 2023 governorship election, and that he won with uh, 3,799 valid votes. Chairman of both political parties had their views on the outcome of the judgments. We have held back to principle instead of any kind of material reward or inducement that is going on everywhere in this country. We want to appreciate them that they will be honored and their children shall reap from what they have done. Their grandchildren shall reap from what they have done for upholding the truth at least for once in this state. The tribunal in split judgment two to one have given PDP the two judges, but the dissenting judgment was rooted because it was it's a, it has explained everything. The APC and Governor Sule are currently considering an appeal against the judgment of the tribunal. Godwin Agua, TVC News, Lafia.